only the present moment contains life. Thich Nhat Hanh. You'll never be sorry for telling someone you love them. Do it before it's too late. Betrayal never comes from your enemies. When you realize how perfect everything is, you will tilt your head back and laugh at the sky. Buddha Many people die at 25 and aren't buried until they are 75. Luck is what happens when preparation meets opportunity. Your task is not to seek for love, but merely to seek and find all the barriers within yourself that you have built against it. Rumi Whatsoever is now present, and from day to day hath its existence, all objects of memories, and the minds and memories themselves incessantly consider, all things that are have their being by change and alteration. Use thyself therefore often to meditate upon this, that the nature of the universe delights in nothing more than in altering those things that are, and in making others like unto them. So that we may say, that whatsoever is, is but as it were the seed of that which shall be. For if thou think that that only is seed which either the earth or the womb receiveth, thou art very simple. Falling down is an accident, staying down is a choice. People will say almost anything when they're happy. Be wise and careful of this one. A man who has committed a mistake and doesn't correct it is committing another mistake. Confucius We must all hang together, or assuredly we shall all hang separately. To be truly happy, you have to be willing to let go of what makes you unhappy. The graveyard is the richest place on earth because it is here that you will find all the hopes and dreams that were never fulfilled, the books that were never written, the songs that were never sung, the inventions that were never shared, the cures that were never discovered, all because someone was too afraid to take that first step, keep with the problem, or determined to carry out their dream. Les Brown against a person who showed his partisanship in an unseemly way in a theater, the governor of Epirus having shown his favor to an actor in an unseemly way and being publicly blamed on this account, and afterward having reported to Epictetus that he was blamed and that he was vexed at those who blamed him, Epictetus said, What harm have they been doing? These men also were acting as partisans, as you were doing. The governor replied, Does then any person show his partisanship in this way? When they see you, said Epictetus, who are their governor, a friend of Caesar and his deputy, showing partisanship in this way, was it not to be expected that they also should show their partisanship in the same way? For if it is not right to show partisanship in this way, do not do so yourself. And if it is right, why are you angry if they followed your example? For whom have the many to imitate except you, who are their superiors? To whose example should they look when they go to the theater except yours? See how the deputy of Caesar looks on. He has cried out, and I too then will cry out. He springs up from his seat, and I will spring up. His slaves sit in various parts of the theater and call out, I have no slaves, 
but I will myself cry out as much as I can and as loud as all of them together. You ought then to know when you enter the theater that you enter as a rule and example to the rest how they ought to look at the acting. Why then did they blame you? Because every man hates that which is a hindrance to him. They wished one person to be crowned. You wished another. They were a hindrance to you and you were a hindrance to them. You were found to be the stronger and they did what they could. They blamed that which hindered them. What then would you have? That you should do what you please and they should not even say what they please. And what is the wonder? Do not the husbandmen abuse Zeus when they are hindered by him? Do not the sailors abuse him? Do they ever cease abusing Caesar? What then does not Zeus know? Is not what is said reported to Caesar? What then does he do? He knows that if he punished all who abuse him, he would have nobody to rule over. What then? When you enter the theater, you ought to say not, let Sophron be crowned, but you ought to say this, Come, let me maintain my will in this matter so that it shall be conformable to nature. No man is dearer to me than myself. It would be ridiculous then for me to be hurt, injured, in order that another who is an actor may be crowned. Whom then do I wish to gain the prize? Why the actor who does gain the prize? And so he will always gain the prize whom I wish to gain it. But I wish Sophron to be crowned. Celebrate as many games as you choose in your own house, Nemean, Pythian, Isthmian, Olympian, and proclaim him victor. But in public do not claim more than your due, nor attempt to appropriate to yourself what belongs to all. If you do not consent to this, bear being abused. For when you do the same as the many, you put yourself on the same level with them. I have to let go of what was for what is. This is the reality. And the moment that I accept reality, all of a sudden, everything changes. When we accept the truth, and we bend to its power, and we step out of lying into living. This is freedom. The man who lives a lie is the man who is his own prisoner. The truth will set you free. Nothing more. The truth will set you free. Nothing more. I choose to live by choice and not by chance. I choose to make changes and not excuses. I choose motivation over manipulation. I choose to excel and not compete. I choose self-esteem over self-pity. I choose to listen to the voice from within versus the voices from without. I choose to fulfill my destiny. I choose to get the job done. I choose to finish what I started. No fear, no hesitation, no surprise, no doubt. Free yourself from the debilitating disease of fear. It has manipulated you long enough. It has tranquilized your faith. The fear of inadequacy. The fear. Except that you will make mistakes and learn from them instead of dwelling on them. Do not focus on perfection or control. You are not in control of anything, and there is no such thing as perfection. The ultimate aim of martial arts is not having to use them. Get beyond love and grief. Exist for the good of man. Miyamoto Musashi Life is not a problem to be solved.